I'm going to be starting a music series which is basically all around the guitar and like all the like aspects of learning the guitar and all of that. For now, I want to start off with something really easy and simple and that is guitar picks and the, the not grip, grippy ones because I know you can get grip. So let's get started. So right now I have eight picks on my desk here. Now, you may be wondering why I have eight and what the differences are. So I'm going to sort them into piles right now. Okay, so now they are in the, the pile. So now I'm going to go through the differences between these three piles. So this pile here, you can probably tell that it, it blends into the desk a bit. You can probably tell that this one is a bit flimsy and a bit bendable. Now this kind of capo, uh, believe it or not, is actually a light capo. And now these ones. Um, I want to talk about these ones in a minute, by the way, so I'm just going to go through these. So you can see that I have two of the same. These are medium. They are slightly bendable, but they aren't that bendy. And the difference between the light and the medium is that the medium ones are a bit thicker. These ones, you can get picks from music stores. Okay, so now I've gone through those. These ones aren't branded, they don't have a brand. But these ones here, they do have a brand, but unfortunately, the brand is actually worn off. You can't really see it. And it was 0.71 millimeters. So these are medium. And then we have this little fella on its own. Now, this is the reason why I don't own a lot of heavy picks. This is the only heavy one I have. And the reason why it's called a heavy is because it's not bendable at all. Well, it is. These two picks I actually got, um, actually came with my new guitar. I will talk about my guitar in a new episode, so don't worry about that. Um, and I'll also talk about the amplifier in a different episode. And you can probably tell that these capos are not gripped at all. You can get gripped ones. They they look very intimidating. To, but I think I'm going to stick with the non-gripped ones. And the reason because is even though you do get sweaty fingers and the picks can slide through your fingers and it can just drop like that. If you're having trouble with these non-gripped um, picks, then I have a way that you can actually make it a bit more grippy and so it doesn't fall out of your, fall out of your fingers as much, which saves a lot of time by the way. And this method is hairspray. Now, you must think I'm going crazy right now because why are you using beauty products on musical products? Now, the reason is because hairspray has is sticky. Um, yeah, that's quite self-explanatory. But hairspray is great for a lot of things. So with the hairspray, I'm just going to be taking the one I have been using today, and this, and that is this red one. The reason why I love the red one at the moment is because it just, with my new guitar, I'm going to use one of its picks that I've got given. So with the hairspray, you're just going to, I'm not actually going to do this on my desk. So let's move the camera up. So with this, you just want to take the hairspray and you're going to hold the pick like this. So you're not gonna so you're not gonna get like hairspray on your fingers. And if you do get hairspray on your fingers, don't worry. If you get it on your nails, it's also fine. Um, because your nails actually made out the same 
stuff as your hair and then once you're holding it correctly you're just gonna and I'm just going to hold it a little bit away and break, break. And there you have it. The other side isn't hairspray. So you can also do the other side if you want, but I would only recommend the side that you would put your thumb on. So thanks for watching. I hope this helped you in a way. If you like this, then give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to see more of this series and more of me. I also make other videos besides this music series and I will see you next time. Bye! And also share with your friends because it might even help them.